but first, okay, ladies, drop whatever you're doing because you're going to want to see every second of this next story. Okay, take a good seat, get yourself comfortable because the men you're about to see in this new calendar are not only sexy, they're all OSU students. News Center's Yolanda Harris is live in the newsroom now to introduce us to some of the hottest men on campus. Yolanda? That's right. Ladies, are you tired of all those pinup calendars featuring scantily clad, half naked women? Well, now there's a calendar just for the ladies. And the best part, these studs can be found right on the Ohio State campus. It's sexy, provocative, and backed by popular demand. 13 hotties hoping to heat things up. What are these, a bunch of guys? Not just any guys, it's the annual campus men calendar featuring the sexiest guys at OSU. We have guys that look like that on campus. <laughs> the beefcake photos have shocked quite a few co-eds. His body is definitely awesome. The risque pictures can even jog some memories. Oh my God, he lived my time last year. <laughs> Model Mike Ball is Mr. Fall, heating up October, November, and December. I've always wanted to be in a, like a modeling type deal. I actually want to kind of get into acting, but I'm, my major is accounting, just to be safe. It's tough to believe these guys aren't professional models, especially since the pictures are so erotic. A lot of the pictures, you're, yeah, you're totally naked and behind whatever you're behind. <laughs> but these guys aren't hiding their newfound fame. I walked into a suite up in uh, up the upstairs, and. Every single room had my picture up, so as soon as I walked in, they're like, oh, it's Mr. Fall. Yet not everyone is brave enough to bear it all. If I had the body to do it, I, I think uh, I wouldn't. But the girls are definitely glad these studs did. I think I like Mr. July. <laughs> Oh, my. Well, the school, to clear things up, has no involvement in putting out this calendar, and you won't see their logo anywhere in the photos. Live in the newsroom, I'm Yolanda Harris for Columbus's News Center. Don't see much of anything in those photos, <laughs> okay. except for sports equipment. I didn't, okay, well, moving right along to sports, 